So is it possible that your plants need Greek yogurt? Maybe. Let's cultivate. All right, so today we are not talking about yogurt, but we are talking about the beneficial bacteria that you find in yogurt. And from the jump, I just wanna make a nice you know, connection here between what we need to do as human beings to support our gut biome and what we need to do in our cultivation practice to support the plant's gut biome. So the amazing thing that is now become a more prevalent part of health and wellness is the importance of probiotics and the role that they play in our immune system. So they say that 80% of our immune system is found in our, in our gut. And the beneficial bacteria that we get with yogurt and probiotics is the cornerstone of maintaining that healthy gut biome and ultimately a healthy immune system and a healthy functioning human being. With plants, the correlate is identical. So the three components today that I really want you to dial into and remember from today's uh, episode is the importance of nutrient cycling with these beneficial bacteria, the importance of the immune function support that they provide to those plants, and the third component is, of course, with those first two, you have a healthier, happier plant that is gonna increase yields and an overall better finished product. So with that said, Let's get into it. Today, we're gonna to look at two products with the same bacillus bacteria that we find in that yogurt. We're gonna look at those in these products that we use in our cultivation here on the farm. First product is uh, by a company uh, called Blacksmith uh, Bioscience, and they have a product here called Armory that right on the bag, it says beneficial bacillus blend. And that's exactly what it is. It is a beneficial blend of bacillus bacteria. And when we talk about these beneficial bacteria, the first component that we are gonna focus in on is nutrient cycling. So for those of you who don't know what nutrient cycling is, let's just say that it is making the nutrients, whether it's phosphorus, nitrogen, calcium, bioavailable to the plant. So nutrients and, and, and compounds can come in forms that are not bioavailable, that cannot be taken up by that plant. And the role of the bacteria, the fungi, the amoeba, the flagellates, all of these microscopic organisms in the soil, their task and their job is to unlock that nutrient and make it bioavailable to the plant. Nutrient cycling. So Armory is one of those off-the-shelf solutions that provides a beautiful blend of bacillus bacteria that ultimately supports the plant in that function and ultimately supports the plant's immune system. And one of the components that's in this product that we love is Streptomycin griseus. So Streptomycin is one of those very unique uh, uh, components that is a Think of it as a plant antibiotic. In fact, if you look at the word, it kind of sounds like one of those antibiotics that you took when you were cleaning up one of your infections recently. So streptomycin is one of those uh, beautiful uh, compounds that is an anti-pathogenic uh, bacteria that is uh, right here in this Armory product. And it's one of the reasons why we use it is for that immune support for the plant. The other product that I want to talk about today that we absolutely love is Photosynthesis Plus. And Photosynthesis Plus is similar to Armory in that it is a nice blend of bacillus bacteria. But what you get from the Photo P, as we like to call it, is a, are a couple of bacteria that they have isolated and created this shelf stable product where the bacteria actually can attached to the chloroplast of that plant leaf. The chloroplast is just that cell wall of the plant. These bacteria can actually make their way into the chloroplast, and these are bacteria that are photosynthetically driven. They are able to absorb light in order to uh, do their thing. And by attaching to the chloroplast, you're now expanding that spectrum of light that this plant can absorb. 
So you not only have uh, a blend of bacteria in this product that is similar to what the Armory is conferring, which is overall improvement of nutrient cycling, but you also have a bacteria that is increasing the plant's capacity to photosynthesize, to capture the carbon, to convert that carbon to sugar. That's the magic of photosynthesis. And this product ultimately supports that. So with these two products, where you're improving your nutrient cycling and you're improving the immune system of your plant, you're creating a healthier, happier plant that's more vigorous, that's able to access all of that nutrient in the soil, thereby making a healthier, better plant. So in general, these two products, if you're not at the stage in your cultivation where you are making compost teas and working on generating a biological brew for your plants, these are two solutions that are right off the shelf. You can order them on Amazon. You don't have to get a full five gallon bucket like this. You can get a small one liter uh, container. And I, and I will put a little disclaimer here and a PSA for the Photosynthesis Plus. It's a product that is unbelievably potent, incredibly effective, but smells absolutely terrible. So, smells bad, works great. The Armory is just in a powder form that solubilizes in water, so no issues with smell there. Both products doing a very similar task of improving that nutrient cycling, improving the plant's immune function, and increasing the overall yields. If you want to learn more about how we think about soil biology and fertility and the role of beneficial bacteria in our cultivation, be sure to check out our online course. We've got tons of information there for you. And until next time, keep on cultivating.